Do you ever find that when you're building a Lego mock and you get two Lego pieces stuck together and you just can't get them apart and when you go to get your brick separator to separate them, you can't find it because your desk is so cluttered with Lego? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you a simple solution so you'll never lose your brick separators again. First up, you'll of course need some brick separators. You'll need some kind of 1x1 Lego plate. I'm using a 1x10 plate because I have three brick separators, but you could use whatever size you want, as well as any color you want. Like in my case, I'm using a color that I have a lot of. Depending on which brick separators you will be mounting to this mount, you will need some tiles. I'm using a brick popper as well as an old style brick separator, so I have a red tile for the brick popper as well as a grey tile for the old grey brick separator. The final item you will need will be plastic cement. You also need a good spot to mount your brick separators. The first step we have to do is to assemble the tile onto the brick separator. The first thing I'm going to use is this brick popper. So I'm going to clear off the edges here to make sure it's like completely all good and then I'm going to take my liquid cement and I'm just going to glue around where I want to put the tile. So I put a little much on that just because I did that on purpose. Now I'm going to stick the tile on and make sure you line it up because if it's not lined up it's not going to be stay straight on your holder and if you're like me that's going to drive you nuts. So see, this is what you want your brick popper to look like. You're going to pretty much repeat the same process with this old style brick separator, but let's face it, it's going to be a little bit harder because of the edges here. I recommend letting these dry for a while before you start to use them on the mount. Assembling the brick separator mount is very easy because it is just this plate. What you're going to do is you're going to glue the back of the plate and you're going to stick it onto the edge here. Now after you've waited a couple minutes, it should be done. So now all you need to do is fasten the tiles onto the mount. And there you have it. And there you have it. Your custom Lego brick separator mount has been assembled so you should never be able to lose your brick separators again. Thanks so much for watching this Brick Lover 18 LEGO video. If you enjoyed this video and you want to subscribe for all LEGO all the time, click the subscribe brick and you'll subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our previously uploaded LEGO YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there containing all our videos. If you want to see more Brick Lover 18, head on over to BrickLover18.com where you'll find the links to our Twitter and our Instagram and our Brick One. Before you go, don't forget to leave a like on this video as well as a comment. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already by clicking the subscribe brick. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day.